Hey guys, welcome here for Devious Production, and I'm bored, and I'm maroon crafting at the moment, which is, uh, you know, it's not that bad. Like, I don't know why people bitch on it so much, but anyway, um, uh, yeah, what I did this afternoon. This is a little story. Um, what happened was, I came home. I went to go open the front door. It was locked. Both my parents were out, and they didn't get back until reasonably late. And I'd finished school like one o'clock but I'd stayed around because the bus didn't come for a while so I could get home so I stayed around a little bit and then I went and caught the bus home I got home and I'm like oh shit I can't get in so anyway I'm like uh I'll check for open windows so I walk around my house find try and find an open window and I'm looking I'm looking I'm looking I'm looking and then I'm like oh crap there's no open windows anywhere and then I'm like oh shit oh shit I'm not going to be able to get inside until like five o'clock, which, and at the time it was only about one ish, or actually, no, it was about two. So I'm like, oh, fuck. Got like a good three hours of sitting out here. So I just start, um, I'm just like, oh, crap, what can I do? What can I do? So I go into the garage and I pull out, um, a, like a really big long screwdriver, and I'm like, okay, maybe if I put this like where the latch is, I can maybe jimmy it open a little bit. So I start doing that, nothing happens, and I'm like, okay, draw back in there, and I get a hammer. And this time I get um, I get the screwdriver, I get it so the latch is just showing, and then I start whacking it. And of course the screwdriver is too fat on the barrel, so it doesn't go in. So then I walk back, and I get a, I'm trying to think of the name, a set square, no, not a set square. Um, it's a device for getting the perfect corners on wood. It's a woodworking tool, I don't know, can't remember what it was called. I remember using them back when I did woodwork. I don't do it anymore, though. I can't remember the name. And then I tried to do that, but the same thing by hammering it in. Nothing happened. So I'm like, oh, shit. So then I go and I get a, what's it called? A uh, pinch bar? I think it's a pinch bar or a crowbar. I, can't, I don't know the difference between the two. And I start trying to use that to get the window open. And that's not working. So I eventually give up, pack it all up, and I'm just like, well, fuck, I'm going to have to sit out here for another, like, three hours. So I'm just like, mm. And then in one large, like, because of where I live, I live pretty close to the beach, and there's a lot of little insects that bite your legs. So I'm like, okay, I'm over this. I'm sick of them biting me. So what I do is I walk in. I get one, two, I get two screwdrivers, and all I did, ended up doing, it was so quick, it happened, all I did was just put it next to the lock, bent it one way a little bit, and then I bent it the other way, and the lock popped open. I was like... Why couldn't that do that the first time I do it? I was like, meh, I'm inside now. I can get back to feeding my RuneScape addiction. Anyway, I just thought I'd like to tell you that little story. So that that's immoral. If you want to break into a house, use a screwdriver. It's very, very, very helpful. You only need one. It's better if it's flathead. And it sounds like I've broken into a lot of houses. I've really only broken into my own and a friend's house because we were locked out and it was raining and his parents were out for like the weekend and he was home alone so it was just kind of like yeah you know i don't really want it. he's like yeah I'm, you're not staying in my place cunt so anyway i uh, just thought i'd share that with you and anyway rock lord signing off